Greetings Immortals and welcome back to another video. Today we're playing a game that's a little on the strange side. Uh, Stronghold Crusader 1 HD. Uh, this is a really old game. This, old, this game is like 15 years old at this point, at least. Uh, I would dare say it's probably about 20 years old at this point. Greetings, uh, sire. The desert awaits you. But I used to play this game all the time when I was really little. So I'm kind of like trying to capitalize on the fact that YouTube thinks that most of y'all are the same age as me. So maybe you guys remember this game, maybe you don't. But I used to play it at my grandmother's house all the time. Uh, my memos and I don't know. I just, I really, uh, we're going to play through the campaign. So we're going to start with the first thing and, uh, Mortal Jimmy against Sutan Abdul. Um, uh, so I'm going to kind of explain the game as we go. Can I not? Oh, wow. You can't even use the, um, the WSD to move. You just kind of. Uh, let, me, let me go ahead and get Your things set up. Is falling. I know I, I've got to build a granary right away. Where is it? I don't remember where anything is. I can't build. There it is. Uh, let's build it back here in the back a little bit. So that should help us out. Uh, it gave us some stone as well, but we ran out of stockpile space. So I'm gonna spend a little. I actually don't even think that costs anything. I think you can just like infinitely. Yeah, that doesn't cost anything to move the stockpile. Uh, immediately, I want to get some people cutting down trees. So we're gonna get a few woodcutters' huts here together. Uh, also, it'd be good to get a quarry going. Uh, this is a real-time strategy game, so we're like going against time here um, And the people we're trying to go against is these right here um, As you can see he's already getting his base started up. So basically we got to beat him We're at war with each other, and he's gonna be trying to kill us, and we're gonna be trying to kill him. So uh, We've got some iron mines up there Not enough work is available to run this building. That's honestly, okay We'll get that set up. Uh, we'll do dairy for cheese. Uh, apples is really good to have. And we'll get a, a wheat farm. That should be good. Uh, we'll go ahead and build a hovel so that we can get some more people coming in. Um, I would like to... I would like to honestly... In the treasury lord make some slight taxes low taxes that's fair march these taxes Bet march these taxes but that's okay i'm gonna make up for it in other ways by keeping my people happy uh so we're just gonna put flags up there just just for the cool cool factor uh listen we're gonna put a little town garden around that so that we just to increase the um, people having fun we'll make a statue um, I don't know exactly where we're gonna put it but let's make this cross statue right here So that increased uh, popularity with the fear factor. So right now it's zero right now. Uh, we can help with that by um, helping with the religion, religion stuff. So like basically you can get buffs and debuffs based on how you run. You can um, do it based on uh, like how, how did I get off of the screen? Hey, you right click. They get the trees. Oh man, they're just right there. So uh, I'm gonna put my I'm gonna you put a couple couple guards over here just to kind of guard We're my stuff. Now. Not many. I just want to warn them if they get too close to any of my stuff Moving off. that they're gonna get shot. You know. 
We're just gonna we're just gonna kind of stake our claim here. We're at war. I'm not going to attack him per se. Where are we going? Uh, we'll have him patrol. Are they taking Are they taking shots? I don't know he's got people patrolling his stuff. So, off we go. Have Always you patrolled ready. this way? Are they attacking or are we being attacked? I really can't tell if we're being attacked or. I think we're attacking them. I think they're taking a shot every now and again at these guys over here. I'm okay with that. We're we're at war, so if they yes, get my lordship. This is gonna be the easiest place for them to come across, so we'll have a couple people. Uh see they're immediately look look like they're trying to send an attack. So that's not good. We need to be um Need to build a mercenary post. So we'll get a couple couple people for now. Uh, we got an armory. It's gonna take us a little while to get like. Yeah, brother, you might wanna. I don't know what, what he's trying to do. Oh, he's fighting over the, the stuff over there. Okay, so this is where I'm gonna send. I'm gonna send some people this way to try to make sure that. Oh no, he's he's definitely coming to attack. That's definitely his 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 idea here. Oh yeah, they're definitely trying. Defend, defend, defend. Are you sending more people over there? Yeah, I see that. Uh, what are you doing? Attack. Yeah, these are they're coming straight in. They're literally going to get arrowed to death, though, I think. From the Don't I shoot. Wind blows hard towards your home. Oh, shut up. Little turd. Okay, I literally can't. Focus, focus. Oh, God. Oh, crap. Okay, so... This is bad. This is very bad. So instant, like that, he's gonna attack immediately. While it be piece of cake. So go ahead and take care of those. So I'm gonna meet them with my people. This sucks because he's immediately attacking. Um, we're not getting enough iron, really. Uh, crap. See, I've, I took too long to explain things. Uh, let's do a blacksmith workshop. Uh, armor workshop. And a Fletcher. So we've got some jobs for them to be doing. But another hovel, let some more people come in. Your popularity, our treasure is empty. Well, raise the taxes a little bit, unfortunately. That has to happen, but uh, to kind of compensate for that, I'm going to build a church over here in the back. A message from the Sultan. The sky was not bright for the Sultan today. No, it was not. Please quit trying to attack me. So, uh, yeah, you better retreat if you're going to die, dude. Brother, you better, you better calm yourself because you're you're obviously gonna get wrecked. Unfortunately, my guys are moving really slow. They're good armor and stuff, but but they're um they're not very good at like getting these range guys. So I don't know if he'll keep running away. All right, my only goal was really to like run him off. That's really all I cared about. Um, that right down there is going to be a really hard place to like defend against. So I just really need to watch him. So those are the two places we can cross the river. You can't cross over here. So I'm going to send some troops over there to kind of, uh, deal with that. Uh, armor's workshop. Oh, blacksmith. I can either make macemen or sword people. I think I'm going to make sword people though. And we're going to get bows. Uh, we can make armor. 
So we're building up our armory a little bit. I need to make I need to uh, make a, a little marketplace, and that will kind of allow us to buy buy and sell goods. So if we make a lot of goods that we don't need, um, then we can sell them uh, in exchange for goods that we do need. So that's kind of our, our thoughts here. Our thought processes. Uh, do we have any good areas back there that we can... Uh, I think I'm going to double down the iron mine. Okay, the worker is taking some time off. See, uh, with the good and the bad, if you have a lot of good... Like, good... Uh, your workers will actually take some time off, uh, sometimes, and that's really not good. So let me. We're actually having to pay for mercenaries, and that's not how I want to do. It. I'd rather produce my goods and then have like a barracks. But for now, I'm gonna have to kind of copy his tactics just to keep up with how often he's attacking me. Oh, we just built the barracks. We can make a few archers. And we can make a few real... These guys are really strong. Like, compared to the Arabic people. Like, they're really strong. But we're going to put a couple... couple, couple of these guys over here. And then... I'll buy a couple more and put them... Over here. To kind of stay near my farms and stuff. Uh, we may have we, we may have cleared off enough space to make a wheat farm. Yeah, we can make a wheat farm now. Uh, we could turn into flour. Three food types eaten. So, the 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 more different fruit food types you get, the happier people are. That makes a lot of sense. Um, and since we're fighting an Arabic guy, it would probably be smart to buy a whale. Which means that if he sends slaves over here to try to burn our stuff down, um, are they attacking our stuff? Or are we attacking their stuff? I think we're attacking their stuff, mostly. Wait, why did he... Why did he put that there? Oh, he's sending troops over. We salute you! You guys go over there and defend. These guys are going to be better for defense. And these guys will probably be better for um, attacking. So we'll probably use a mixture of Arabic and non-Arabic people to kind of... Um, we are under attack. I don't know exactly what they're trying to go for. But if we keep like shooting their ox people... Then I'm, he's going to get tired of it, obviously. But that would also mean that ours is very well defended. So we won that. We won that for sure. Um, we may need another. That armor smith is uh, doing better. He's doing things faster than our weapon smith. Uh, so we may do a pole turner's workshop as well. Let's go ahead and build another hovel just so we have some people on standby. Um, we'll put it back here. It really doesn't matter where it goes. That's is our hate husband, you know. Uh, so we got uh, marriage is happening. People are, are really happy. Uh, what's our total total popularity? Okay, good. See, so it's it's a little eh. The fear factor has actually gone down a little bit. Uh, so we can buy a maypole here for the children to play on. Make another town garden. Over here. That may be in the way, so I may need to put a town garden like over here. Just so they can Okay, we are. We're under attack. My lord. I don't think those are going to get through. Commander, Salzman, attack. So let's back them up with the little little archery support. 
I really like having these guys right here because their range is really, really good. So I'm going to chill out there. They haven't attacked this way yet. So that's why I'm not too worried about this area. But I do want to make sure I have them within range. In case they do. Wait, I don't think they can. I don't think they can come this way. No, they can't. They literally can't come this way, I don't think. Yeah, they can. They would have to go all the way around, though. So I think we need to focus our defense efforts um, up here. Let's just send this guy up here. And then we'll have one guy at each farm or something. So we'll have these guys like watching over the farm just to make sure that any attacks there. So we'll get him close to the water there where he can throw stones over the water the entire time. So I didn't even realize that that would be really hard for them to get over there. So when we make a wall, we need to go ahead and make one right here. Um, I'm going to... Wandering randomly. Um, I'm going to delete one recutter's hut there and make one up here because I, I want this to be cleared out up here. Um, but slowly but surely so that we can start uh, putting stuff up here. So we're starting to get a little bit of weed in so we can start trying to uh, make a meal and a bakery. That'll kind of help with food production a little bit. Uh, we have no food right now. So I need to... Buy some. I'm going to buy a little bit of everything. Just to help us out a little bit. No space in the stockpile. Okay, no space in the stockpile. That's the not a good... Is full, my lord. Okay, 10-4. We can continue pulling this out like this. Uh, we need to make another sword shop. Another blacksmith shop. We need to capitalize on the iron some more too. He don't really care about the iron too much unless he just wants to sell it. So he don't really... But we need plenty more. Unfortunately, I've got to cross this river to get to it. So... Um, I need a couple people... Like, specifically to protect these. Because he could decide to attack those at any moment. He could essentially put a halt to some of that. Put it there. So I'm just going to basically show a force, put some people that way. So he's basically not going to ever get get very much stone. As you can see, he's already like built a little keep, though. In a little bit of time that he's had. But he will never be able to restock it for based on how often we're shooting his stuff. And my guys are basically going to continually take shots at him. So I have increased my defense there. So he may decide to try to hit me from this side because it is definitely a weak side. But I will see it coming a lot sooner. What's, what's, he, what's he up to? So he's going full send on the wood there. I may need to do the same as well. Uh, I've got a lot of stone so I could probably start trying to... Um, build walls. It's going to be kind of hard. Some of my stuff is going to be unprotected with walls. Uh, but I would definitely like to just kind of start walling off some of these areas. Like if all I did was wall this off, that's like good enough to... I could be mean and like put the stone wall over his stuff so he literally can't even get it. Like, he would never, like, be able to get over there. Which I think just having people sniping him is fine. Is full, my lord. Hey, the armory is full. That's good. That means I can sell some stuff. I can sell some of the stuff that I'm not really planning on using as much. I'll sell a handful. It's a good problem to have. It's a really good problem to have. Oh, we don't need as much stone as we got. A little bit of that. Okay. We really need to improve 
dairy and other other foods types. It looks like he may be getting ready to do something. Kind of watching him. His troops isn't... He doesn't have a whole lot of troops, but he has cleared out a lot of wood. So maybe I should be doing the same. They are doing a pretty good job, but I'm, I need them to clear out this area a little faster. Not that I necessarily need the wood. I just need... Under attack. under attack. What's happening? Yeah, he attacked. They're attacking these people over here. You guys go over here and defend this guy. Uh oh. Uh, we may have a little little issues here. We stand ready. This is too easy. We are under attack. Nope. Nope. Try again. See, when I, whenever I was um. <laughs> Whenever I was first doing this game, like a long time ago, I really didn't understand like military warfare tactics like this. Uh, luckily, you don't have to feed your army, which is kind of like backwards, really. But um, that's just kind of a game mechanic. Uh, you only have to feed your peasants and your workers, so they're the only ones that consume food. So really, you are really it would really behoove you to like. So. Spread these out a little bit. Just to make sure like nobody like walks up. No like stone like if he puts the stone throwers there to try to kill these guys, I wanna make sure that can't happen. If they're walk if they have to walk all the way over here, they're gonna get shot going over there. Like obviously. So this isn't working. Maybe we'll just do walls to kind of further funnel them in. I don't know. That's fine. Uh, we're going to have to get through their walls, which is going to really suck. I've got like watchtowers and stuff. And um, they can actually shoot fire arrows from these areas. So that's actually a lot more powerful as well. Um, We're getting really close to being able to attack them, I think. Let's put another hobble. Let's, uh, we need to step up our troop production majorly. We can make, like, uh, stables. So I put our horses in. I think we're getting about time. It's getting about time to go try to attack him. So we need another armory. This guy is kind of working a little slower now. So we need this armor to catch up. Let's hire him some help. Oh boy, this is gonna be bad. Yep. Uh, the tides are definitely turning. Tides are definitely turning. Like it was always looking good. And this is the first level, it's gonna get harder. Oh, they're going down, bro. They are going down, dude. It's happening. This is happening. Any and all able bodies. Are going for that. Maybe we need to chill out with the ram for just a moment. Let them guys kind of go in front just a little bit. Oh, yeah, they, they know what's up. Arches ready. We are under attack. No, nope, we are attacking. Oh, this is looking really, really good. Alright guys, you guys go over here. As well. My boy's yours. 
any extra archers That's come to this way. side? He's definitely probably prepared for an for an attack. A few right, bows, a little closer, close enough to start shooting their um, shooting these guys up here. A message from the Sultan. The pond is dying in the Sultan's yes. oasis. Yes, the pond is drying. Uh, where is our uh -huh. siege machine? Simple. A message from the Sultan. The red sky approaches the Sultan's fortress. Yes, yes it does, buddy. Yes, you are going down, my guy. You are going, and I drug this out a little bit, obviously. I probably could have attacked him way sooner. With, with good enough tactics, I probably could have taken them on. But I wanted it for sure. Ram ready, my lord. He just destroyed everything. He just destroyed all of that. I'm not sure what his thoughts for, Is he trying to produce more units? I'm gonna try to open that up as well. He's trying. It looks like he is buying more units. He knows it's coming too. He's the olive branches weep at the Sultan's loss. Once more onto the bridge. Get him, get him. Go, 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 go. Everybody, go, go, go! It's a route. We got it. Wait, why did it go back to mine? I want to see. No, I want to see. As all must sleep, the sleep of the ancients. So must the poor Sultan. We win. Yes. So that's the basis of this game. Obviously, it's gonna get way harder. And the odds are going to progressively get stacked more and more against me as well. Um, we only lost 38 troops uh, and we killed 135. So he lost more troops. I'm not really sure how he lost more troops. I uh, got more gold. It showed you all the food produced. He didn't produce any food. Oh, so he must have had to buy everything. That makes a lot of sense. I got all the iron. So that's why he was having a tough time, probably. Highest population was higher. Uh, he actually had a really good, like a good fear factor. He was really good to his people. Uh, yeah, so that's kind of the thought process of this. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and record one more episode just in case you guys really like it, but this is the only planned episode for me to release. Um, so if you guys wanna see more, you know what to do, hit the like button down below. This is a little different, I know, but please, you know, give it a chance. Uh, yeah, I'm sure it's going to get more interesting if you perhaps thought this episode was a little on the boring side. So, yeah, with that, God bless. See you guys later. Enjoy the rest of your day.